single channel MT electromagnetic instrument, operation video. The standard configuration of single channel MT electromagnetic instrument includes host, measuring line, electrode rod, instrument packing box, hammer, operation manual, charger and accessories. The measuring line is connected with the host and the electrode rod, and the electrode rod is inserted into the ground to measure. When using for the first time, the host needs to connect to the network login account. The operation steps are as follows. Press and hold the left edge of the screen and slide to the right to display the hidden menu. Click Settings, select System Wi-Fi Settings. Connect to available wireless networks, and return to the main interface after completion. Click New Measurement, enter the mobile phone number and verification code according to the prompt, and then log in. During measurement, first pull a tape measure at the site to be measured and mark the point position according to the actual situation. To start the measurement, we first set the measurement parameters. Click the new survey on the host, name the survey align name, such as Orchard 01, and set the mapping X coordinate, which is recommended to be 10, so as to facilitate map analysis. Then set the corresponding parameters of this measurement, and select the appropriate depth according to the actual situation. The deeper the depth. The longer the measurement time, the measurement mode is divided into TT mode and MN mode. TT probe mode needs to be equipped with probe sensor accessories, which can be measured when it is placed on the ground of the point to be measured, and MN electrode mode can be measured when two electrode rods are inserted into the ground. Number of single channel measurement channels, fixed as one, the default stacking times of frequency selection is 4. After setting, enter the measurement page. Insert the electrode rod into both ends of the first point at an equal distance in the direction of the measuring line. The measuring point is the middle point of two electrode rods to ensure that the measuring point is at the first point. Connect the measuring line, clamp the electrode rod, and click the measurement button on the host to collect the measurement data of the current point. Then we move the electrode rod equidistant to the second point so that the middle point of the two electrode rods is at the second point. Click the measurement button on the host to measure the data of the second point. By analogy, moving to the electrode rod at an equal distance and repeating the above measurement operations, the data collection of the whole survey line can be completed. After the measurement is completed, click the drawing button to draw isolate map and curved map. Analyze the depth, location and other information of underground objects on site. Matters needing attention. 1. The distance between electrode rods shall be at least 2 m. At least six points can be measured on a survey line before drawing. It is recommended to measure more than 10 points. 2. Avoid high voltage lines, rainy days and other interference with the environment. 